Welcome to Orange Picks. Choosing a movie on Prime Video is a difficult task because there are so many great movies on this platform that it's almost impossible to choose. But don't worry, I've taken up the challenge and selected for you 10 of the highest quality, most impressive and most memorable movies that you can watch right now on Prime Video. Let's get started. Dear God. Get the inspector. This crime is familiar to me. The Raven is a 2012 thriller film. The film is inspired by the life of Edgar Allan Poe and is a fictionalized version of Poe's famous poem The Raven. The movie follows Poe, played by John Cusick, as he races against time to save his lover Emily Hamilton, who has been kidnapped by a serial killer in Baltimore. The suspense-filled scenes and the unusual personalities of the characters make the movie very attractive for the audience. No matter how this ends, I will kill him. Do you have any idea what I did to get to be me? Don't you mess with me, Billy. <laughs> the Ballad of Billy McRae is a 2021 drama film. The movie is based on an old and sickly man, played by David Heyman, who tells his life story before he dies. David Heyman's acting is also very successful. You can feel every difficulty and pain in the character's life. Work for me. You were his. That's how he sees it. His property. So they tell me you were in business back in Canada. Mr. Lamotta, you were a professional boxer from 1941 to 1954, and you were the middleweight champion of the world, is that right? Yes, sir, it was. The Bronx Bull is a 2016 biography drama film. The movie tells the story of Jake LaMotta, one of the most famous names in boxing. After winning the world championship, Jake LaMotta faced and overcame personal and professional challenges in his life. The Bronx Bull is a movie that attracts attention with its real-life story, impressive acting performances and realistic boxing scenes. I just did what I had to do. The movie Baby Assassins tells the story of two high school girls about to graduate. Chisato and Mahiro are also highly skilled assassins. The organization they work for orders them to share a room and integrate into normal society. However, their relationship turns sour. One day, an assassination job gets them in trouble with the local Yakuza and they must work together to survive. With breathtaking action sequences and fun Japanese culture, this movie is sure to be a crowd pleaser. The Endless is a 2017 science fiction thriller film. The film was directed by Justin Benson and Aaron Moorhead and stars the duo themselves. The movie is about two brothers who return to a supernatural place to confront their past. It is particularly noteworthy for its supernatural storyline, suspense-filled scenes and unusual narrative. The Endless is a very impressive movie and is highly recommended for viewers who love science fiction and thriller genres. <laughs> <laughs> debt Collectors is a 2020 action crime film. The film follows two debt collector friends, played by Scott Adkins and Louis Mandler, as they fight their way through a challenging mission. The two friends struggle against a corrupt police force, drug cartels, and a ruthless mafia leader while trying to solve their own problems. With successful acting performances, impressive action scenes, and a surprising plot, the movie invites viewers to a breathless viewing experience. The 
Witch, Part 1 The Subversion is a South Korean action thriller film released in 2018. The movie begins with the mysterious return of Ya Yoon, a long-lost high school student. Although Ya Yoon cannot remember his past, he suddenly discovers that he has special abilities. However, Ya Yoon's abilities draw him into the dangerous events of his past and force him to escape. The movie is an engaging watch with a compelling storyline and extraordinarily strong characters. home to meet my family. We'd love to meet him. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Oh, maybe Trey's a secret service name or something. Like one of Obama's sons. That'd be tight. Grace and Family Christmas is a family comedy movie released in 2020. The movie is about the funny and entertaining events that happen to the Grayson family during the Christmas holidays. The Grayson family comes together to spend the Christmas holidays together. However, funny and absurd events during the holiday leave the family in a difficult situation. The movie, which has a fun and warm story, offers viewers the opportunity to have a pleasant time. Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. If you are tired of searching for the best movie, why don't you put me to work for you? Let me do the work for you, and pick the best from every genre every week. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. It's great to work for you. Bonture Het Begin is a detective film released in 2019. The movie is about the learning process of young detective George D. Cock, who starts a new job in the Amsterdam Police Department, working with experienced detective Jen Boncher. The dark and mysterious atmosphere of the movie manages to draw the audience into the story. The scenes set in the wonderful streets of Amsterdam successfully reflect the atmosphere of the city. Don't miss this movie, which is one of the best examples of the Amsterdam detective tradition. <laughs> Als jij ooit nog eens een laag in de gracht ziet draaien, dan laat ik hem liggen. The Swordsman is a 2020 South Korean film. The movie is about the struggle of a man who was a swordsman during the Joseon period after his daughter is kidnapped. The fight scenes in the movie are quite impressive and visually satisfying. The movie, which confronts the audience with tense and emotional moments from time to time, is also very successful with its story. It is among the successful films of South Korean cinema in recent years. I hope my top 10 movies you can watch right now on Prime Video will inspire you and help you have a good time. Don't forget to let me know in the comments after you watch these movies of my choice. If you liked it, please don't forget to like the video, subscribe to my channel and leave your comments. Your feedback is very important to me. See you in the next video.